guys, welcome to What's New Wednesday. So today we are going to go over all the affordable body care and fragrances that have come out or that are going to come out um, within this next week or so. And um, we also have a lot of sales to talk about as well today. So we are going to cover all of that. We have a ton of stuff going on at Bath and Body Works. Body Care Day is coming up. We just got through a big sale as well. We just got through Candle Day, which I didn't really cover on this channel because it's mostly body care. But we've had a lot of exciting stuff happen. Some more scents dropped at Bath and Body Works. So if that sounds like something that you are interested in, I would love if you stick around and watch this video. If you like content like this and you have not subscribed yet, I would definitely love if you take a moment and hit that subscribe button. And we are just going to get right into this. All right, guys. So today we are going to start with Bath and Body Works. So um, yeah, they just had their like annual big candle day sale this last weekend, but we are rolling into this next weekend, which is awesome because it is body care day, which it's actually like body care weekend, but um, body care day is one of the best days to shop if you're into body care and you haven't picked up like the new scents yet or anything like that, or you have some stuff in mind that you would like to pick up because Body Care Day, the prices drop really, really low. Um, it's every year. So it happens around this time every single year. And the prices go low on like all of the stuff. So it's all body care. So it's not limited to just fragrance mist, lotions, body cream, shower gels, things like that. Like they're actually including like the specialty items as well. So that would be like the body butters, um, the shapeable soap, any kind of like shimmering type products, any of the higher priced products. It usually includes men's aromatherapy, like all the body care. Like this is when everything goes on sale um, as far as body care. So i um, super excited because if you are a reward member, you will get a sneak peek or it's not a sneak peek. You actually get like full access on December 8th, which is Friday. So that's this Friday. So definitely want to watch out for that because sometimes those body butters and the higher priced items do sell out and then it'll just be sold out and not available, especially if you're online. Um, so they should be doing body care day in store and online this year. I believe the um, reward member day, which is the 8th. I believe that can start in store as well. So you can shop in store and online. So December 8th is, you know, the reward member access, but everyone else gets access on the 9th and the, the 10th, which is this weekend. So Saturday the 9th and Sunday the 10th will also be body care days. And so this sale should run through this next weekend. And I believe I do have the price point now and it is only $4.95. So you really can't beat that $4.95, especially for some of those full size body butters and some of those really nice products that you, you know, don't want to splurge on and pay $20 for. Now is the time to get those specialty products for that $4.95 price tag. This is like definitely one of the best prices of the year. I think last year it was even higher. I think it was like $5.50 for Body Care Day last year. But $4.95 is awesome, especially since we've been having so much inflation in this world. It's nice to kind of get a break and be able to try out some really nice things for, you know, a cheaper amount. So I definitely recommend Shopping Body Care Day if you guys need gifts, if you guys need things for yourself, um, if you've been eyeing things that just seem a little too expensive for body care at Bath & Body Works. Now is the time this weekend you get your chance to get pretty much whatever you want for that $4.95 price point. Definitely can't beat it. So yeah, now is the time to shop. So I don't know if I will be shopping Body Care Day or not because I have a lot of the stuff I want and I don't want to get my collection just totally out of control where I can't even use anything up ever because I'm kind of in that situation almost now so I really don't want to keep adding things unless I really truly do think that you know I will definitely love the product or um things like that so 
I'm not sure if I will be shopping body care day or not. I know that my daughter wants a couple things from there that I've been eyeing, but I think they might be sold out of those already. She really wanted the, the little like shimmer fizz lotion, but I don't even see it anywhere online anymore. She got that last year and she loved it. And I was going to try to get it for her this year, but I'm not seeing it. So unfortunately, I'm not sure yet if I'm going to be shopping Body Care Day, but if you are going to be shopping Body Care Day, go ahead and comment below on what you want to get. Like what fragrances do you want to get? What kind of products do you want to pick up? Just let me know down below what you're looking forward to from Body Care Day. Would love to know. And um, they did drop some new products this last Monday. So these products are kind of for Body Care Day, even though they did come out Monday. I'm not sure if they're going to drop any more new products like on the actual body care day or not, but these ones just came out on this last Monday. So I'm going to go over them. So we have Lovely Dreamer, which dropped and that is described as floating, then drifting gently to sleep. So Lovely Dreamer is a repackage. This was out like a really long time ago, I guess. Um, I've never smelt this one or anything like that, but this one is a repackage and the original came out quite a while ago. So the fragrance notes on Lovely Dreamer are fluffy musk, clean woods, white iris, and fresh bergamot. Okay, and then we have the next one, which is carried away. This is kind of the same thing, um, not as far as scent wise or anything, but it came out a really long time ago, I guess, and now it's coming back. So it is a repackage, but it hasn't been out for like a really long time. So carried away is described as getting swept off your feet by your true love. And the fragrance notes in carried away are lush raspberries, juicy pear nectar, white jasmine, and whipped vanilla. All right, so then we have a new one, basically, that is coming out. This is brand new. I don't believe that this has ever been released before. And this one is Meet Me in Miami. And this one sounds like a really tropical type summery scent. So, so yeah, it sounds good, but to me, it's kind of like the wrong time of year. But I know they start with their summer stuff really quickly. So um, right after right after winter and everything comes in like all their spring products and all that stuff. So meet me in Miami is described as unwinding at the pair or poolside cabana all afternoon long. And the fragrance notes in meet me in Miami. So we have like a little complication on meet me in Miami because they released fragrance notes on the bottle that are different than what is listed online. Okay, so Meet Me in Miami, on the bottle of Meet Me in Miami, it says breezy palm trees, cabana coladas, and sun tanned days. Okay, so that is what the bottle says. And then online, the fragrance notes are listed as fresh tangerine, white lotus and coconut water so i don't know what is up with that um i have no idea why the fragrance notes are different on the bottle compared to the description online so if anyone knows go ahead and comment below because we would love to know i have no idea why they have two separate sets of fragrance notes for this it's really odd and the fragrance notes are like totally different from each other so it's kind of strange to me that they have different scent notes on the bottle compared to online or if someone just entered it online wrong or something like that. I have no idea, but, but that one is Meet Me in Miami. And then our last one is Cucumber Melon, which is a repackage. This one has been out so many times, time after time after time, they always bring back Cucumber Melon. So Cucumber Melon is described as cool, sweet, and just so classy. 
And the fragrance notes are crisp cucumber, watery honeydew, summer cantaloupe, sparkling grapefruit, and sheer woods. Okay, so, so definitely looking forward to body care day. There's new scents for it. I'm not sure if any more new ones are going to come out before body care day. I would guess it's probably just these, but we'll see. And um, I also want to address the semi-annual sale as well. So the semi-annual sale starts on December 26th for Bath & Body Works, and that is when they price everything pretty low. As the sale goes on, the prices do drop lower, like toward the very end of the sale, you're going to find a lot of the products that were priced higher at the beginning of the sale dropping to, um, to lower at the end of the sale. We won't see like core products dropping really like so like things like a thousand wishes or um into the night and things like that most likely will not be dropped during the semi-annual sale like those will be full price so body care day is a great day to kind of pick up the things that you might want or need before the semi-annual sale hits and like what makes sense to get. So body care day, you definitely want to focus like on the higher priced items like the body butters, the scrubs, the different kind of novelty items you might want to focus on because those probably won't stick around till semi-annual sale. Most likely those will be all taken up and gone by then. So definitely recommend to focus on those higher priced items during body care day, as well as like more of the core type items. So like if you need into the night, if you need um, Japanese cherry blossom or, you know, some of the really um, core fragrances that they have all the time. Body care is the day to get those, not the semi-annual sale. So definitely keep that in mind when you are shopping these sales and getting ready and planning for these sales because it is more strategic to get some things on body care day rather than wait till the semi-annual sale, if that makes any sense at all. <laughs> okay, so... Now we have some possible fragrances to come soon. So we have seen um, a few fragrances name drop that may be coming soon, which are Denim and Daisies, Forever Sunshine, Endless Weekend, and Sunwash Citrus. So I don't want to focus on these too much because, I mean, it's not for sure that these are coming. <clears throat> but I did want to mention that. And it looks like a lot of the Christmas scents that were left to come for um, body care. Like the ones that I went over, I think it was last week, but a lot of those are not coming in body care. Apparently it was a misprint or something like that. So like we won't be seeing, I guess, a lot of them. And like one that I was really, really excited for was the pistachio and toasted vanilla. But it sounds like that is not coming, unfortunately. So sadly to say, we may not see some of those, but we do have some things to look forward to for sure with Body Care Day coming up and a few new fragrances out. And I will let you guys know more when I know more as well. So now we're going to hop over to Victoria's Secret. So they are having like deals drop daily over there at Victoria's Secret. There's lots of things coming in. They have a ton of gift sets and giftable type items. So they did recently just have a sale for $6.95 on their body care items, which I was able to pick up a few things and I do have a haul coming. So stay tuned for that because I will definitely share that with you guys once I get it. But um, right now, they are actually having the fragrance mist and body lotions $8 for five or more. So it's not quite as good as $6.95, but it's not horrible. It's only like another dollar more, really. So per item, though. So you have to buy five or more to get them for $8 a piece, though. And that does include pink and Victoria's Secret. So it's across the board. 
and then they do have a sale on their fragrances and perfumes buy to get to which isn't a horrible deal it's not a great deal it's not a horrible deal so definitely keep an eye out over there because you we are seeing deals drop daily over there so a lot of um deals like i don't know that they will come ahead or anything so keep an eye out on their website or you know their social media pages or whatever because um they are having deals drop daily and then there is one thing that i do want to cover that is not like bath and body works or victoria's secret so i guess sol de janeiro is going to be coming out with a new fragrance it is not released yet but it will be for the new year so this fragrance is called let's see sol de janeiro Chirosa 59 okay and the fragrance notes are going to be vanilla orchid sugared violet and sheer sandalwood so definitely keep an eye out for that as well if you are a sol de janeiro fan which i know a lot of people are um definitely keep an eye out for that new one coming because that should definitely be exciting um so yeah, definitely keep an eye out. And that is pretty much it for What's New Wednesday. If you guys know of any sales or new products that have dropped recently, go ahead and leave me a comment and let us all know because we would all love to know what is new in affordable body care and fragrance. So um, if you are not subscribed, I would love if you go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you do like this kind of content. If you enjoyed this video, I would love if you go ahead and give me a big thumbs up. And I love you guys so much and I hope you have a beautiful day and I will see you in the next video.